Hey everyone, Wonderbricks here. With my first video in my LEGO Helmet series, so today I'll be doing a review and speed build on 76165 Marvel Studios Iron Man. In this set there is 480 pieces. So looking at the front of the box, we have a nice sleek 18 plus packaging with the completed figure in the middle down bottom tells you its part number and how many pieces are in the set. On the side you have just the logo and where all the components were made. On the back there is another big picture of the finished product but on a different angle to the front of the box. We have three little images. One closest to the left is a half body shot of a real looking Iron Man. The middle image is a straight on image of the completed Iron Man with its height dimensions which are 19 centimeters or 7.5 inches. And the last image is a close up of a real looking Iron Man helmet. On the last side there is just a straight on image of the completed Iron Man. So with all the box art it basically shows you all of the figure so you know what you are getting. So inside the box there is four packets of Lego labelled one to four. You have the instructions and also there is two stickers floating around in there which are his eyes. So I picked this Lego set up for $69 Australian at the start of May online at Target. I wasn't going to get the Marvel helmets with only Iron Man in the first wave. He didn't look the greatest on the box in my opinion and didn't look as good as the first wave of the Star Wars heads but when wave 2 came out this year with Venom he looked awesome so that made my decision. I had to collect the Marvel Helmet collections. Oh well, let's get on with the build. So looking at the instructions on the first page it tells you a little bit of information about Iron Man himself and also what the designer wanted to achieve with this build. So building Iron Man, this was a very easy build. The instruction shows 165 steps to build this model and a part list you need for every step. The only trouble I had was building the stand. I didn't look in the instructions properly and missed a piece so it wouldn't go together so that took me a little bit of time to figure out where I went wrong. You also have to watch out in the fourth packet of pieces when building some of the sub-assemblies. There is a glossy gold on selected edges of some of the pieces you have to put on so just be mindful of that. I had a little bit of trouble mounting his forehead. It didn't want to click into place so I had to play around with that for a little while. So for difficulty for this build I would give it a 1 to 1.5 one out of 5. It was a simple build if you follow the instructions correctly. For enjoyment I would give it a 3.5 out of 5. It was pretty satisfying especially when you're putting on his face. So for looks I would give it a 3.5 out of 5. It looks a lot better than it does on the box and I'm glad I did acquire this set with the curves on the face and the shiny non-studded blocks. It looks good on display which I'll show you in a later video. So a wrap up of the build, the pros are the instructions, they're very easy to follow, you'll have no difficulty building this set. The complete model is very sturdy when you click all pieces incorrectly. Iron Man looks good on display the gold really pops in colour which makes him stand out and this set was very cheap, it only cost $69 Australian so the cons of the build are clicking in some of the parts were a little bit harder than it should have been the instructions show the glossy gold but was a little hard to notice in the instructions and I missed it so I placed a few of the blocks correctly because of that but I fixed them up when I noticed so it took me 82 minutes and 43 seconds to complete this build. If you have this set or are getting this set, let me know how long it took you and your thoughts on it. 
so I'll be releasing another video next Friday it will be Lego 76187 Marvel's Venom I am very excited for this build this is the one in the Marvel range I am most looking forward to build so if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe thank you all for watching see you all in the next video Wonderbricks out